Hello, my wonderful friend. Let's talk about 17 juicy secrets women are scared to tell you. We're going to cover everything from how to impress women and really just how to melt our heart. Tell me this, has there ever been something you've been afraid to tell a woman, like something that has made you feel vulnerable or you've been afraid she'll reject you or something like that? If you're nodding your head yes right now, you are not alone and the truth is, Women have been there too. It's kind of just part of being human. Relationships can feel terribly vulnerable. However, I've discovered that just clearing the air and putting all your cards on the table, so to speak, is the very best approach. You always just wanna come clean. A little communication goes a long way. So I am here to pull back the curtain to reveal 17 juicy secrets that women are scared to tell you. These are deep secrets and along the way, I'm going to give you some powerful insight into how to impress women and how to just melt her heart. This sounds like something you should know, right? So make sure you stay with me until the end of this video so you don't miss any of these powerful secrets. Before we get to that, make sure you subscribe and ring the notification bell. My name is Melanie. I'm a Christian dating coach for men and creator of Attracting Lasting Love Academy. I am your go-to source to learn how to find the absolute love of your life, captivate her, melt her heart, make her fall insanely in love with you so that you can wake up to her soft touch every single morning. So make sure you subscribe and ring the notification bell. And if you'd like to learn more about working with me in my academy, just go to Coach Melanie Dot com. All right, you ready for these secrets? You ready to know how to impress her and melt her heart? Let's get started with my first secret. Secret number one is that when a woman has feelings for you, she thinks about you a lot. <laughs> okay, I know sometimes it can feel like when you're crushing on someone that they play in your mind on repeat and maybe you get a little nervous she doesn't feel the same way. Yeah. When a woman is interested in a guy, she thinks about you a lot. As a matter of fact, if you haven't yet seen this video and this video on signs she's thinking about you, I'll put links in the description below. Make sure you give them a watch. They're going to surprise you. Secret number two is that she is terrified of rejection as well like terrified. <laughs> the honest reality is the girl of your dreams has been rejected, okay? She just has. Women get rejected just like men do. And so she has this fear that it's gonna happen again. And that can certainly mess with her head when she's trying to show interest in you. Now a little bonus secret for you. One of the easiest mistakes that makes her feel rejected the very fastest is when she shows interest in you and then you don't respond. That is like a slap in her face. She puts herself out there to show she's interested in you. And then if you don't respond, it like really crushes her. This is why in my academy, I show you both how to know that she's interested in you and then what to do so that uh, attraction can just grow and grow and blossom into love. So remember, when you're meeting someone new, when you're chatting with that cute gal, she's as scared of rejection as you are. So just kind of go easy on both of you. Secret number three is that she wants you to think she's beautiful without her having to be really fake and feel really fake in how she presents herself. There is so much pressure in society to do all these things that will make you look beautiful. And the truth is most of it is just a giant waste of money, but she feels that pressure because she wants you to think she's beautiful and nothing is quite as calming and reassuring and just ah, melts your heart as when a, as when a man tells you that you look beautiful without makeup or you look beautiful if your hair's not perfect in her mind and all of those things. She really does want you to love the real authentic her and when she, when you tell her that, when you share that with her, that she's beautiful, even when she's not all done up, like society tells her she needs to be, holy cow, that right there is the perfect recipe to just melt her heart. Secret number four is that she needs you to pursue her. 
And yes, I said needs, not just wants. Pursuing a woman correctly, effectively, is one of the single most powerful attraction strategies a man can learn. It is insanely powerful. It makes her feel alive and drawn to you and feminine and beautiful. And it makes her love how she feels when she's around you. Many men feel terrified to pursue. And it's simply because you haven't been taught the the correct way, the most effective way. And that's not your fault. It's not your fault that nobody taught you that. Pursuing the correct way is actually very simple, very easy. It does not have to be overwhelming. It shouldn't be overwhelming. And it actually makes you feel more strong and more confident and more masculine. So it really benefits both of you. This is one of the reasons why I spend so much time teaching you how to pursue correctly in my academy. It's a win-win situation. So don't forget, a woman needs you to pursue her. Just like you have your needs in a relationship and those needs totally matter, she has needs too. And one of them is for you to pursue. Secret number five is that she wants you to be the one for her. And she really hopes that you will be. Sometimes in dating and relationships, we kind of still treat it like it's boy against girl, you know? Like we're against each other and we have to fight to make it work. And that is the perfect recipe for disaster in a relationship. It doesn't work that way. At the end of the day, we just all want the same thing. We all want it to work out. We all want love. We all want to be respected and cared about. We want that search to be over, right? So she wants you to be the one just as much as you do. The key is to know how to show her that you are the man of her dreams. You are the man she wants to spend her life with. You must know how to make her fall deeply in love with you. This is what makes her want to spend her whole life adoring you. It's really the ultimate secret to a happy relationship and keeping that spark alive forever. So what does make a woman fall in love with you? Like what makes her want to spend her life with you and help you keep that spark alive? Have you ever wondered that? This is what I help you master in my academy. And I just created a new free masterclass that's going to share three powerful secrets with you. Stop guessing what makes her fall in love with you and stay in love with you. It's time for you to learn the truth, the powerful strategies that help you captivate her and make her heart yours forever. Can you imagine how freeing it would feel to just have the answers up front? Get started today by watching my free masterclass. Just go to coachmelanie.com slash masterclass. I will put a link in the description below and a link in the pinned comment. If you're struggling with relationships right now because you're wondering if it's even worth trying because you've gotten your hopes up so many times and just had them crushed, this training was made specifically for you. I know the ache you're feeling and I've put together these secrets specifically to guide you through this so you can finally have the success and love that you deserve. I've helped so many men with this. I can't wait to help you with it. So make sure you get started right now and watch that free masterclass. My next juicy secret about women is that she really cares what you think about her. Do you ever get nervous and start to overthink when you're thinking about a cute girl or talking to her or whatever? Pretty much everyone has been there, including her. It's just as easy for her to get anxious, for her to get nervous, for her to start overthinking because she really cares what you think about her. If you've ever felt like maybe it doesn't matter to women, yeah, no. It totally does. She's just trying to play it cool because she's trying to embarrass herself as little as possible. This leads us right to my next secret, which is that she gets nervous when she talks to you. Okay, like that's really, really normal. This might make her stumble on her words or say something super, super random or something that doesn't make sense or maybe even something a little bit stupid. Like that's normal when you're nervous and frankly, you can't think straight because you're not breathing. This is why it's so important not to be too hard on either of you. You're both nervous and that's okay. It's also incredibly powerful and helpful to just brush up on your conversation skills so that the conversation can be very relaxed and easy and exciting for both of you. My next juicy secret about women is that she tells her friends all about you. (laughs) Like there's a chance that they might actually be sick about 
are sick of hearing about you, to be perfectly honest. This is just something women do. We, it's our way of, you know, we're already thinking about you and we want to talk about you because it makes us happy and like excited and she gets like those butterflies and it, ah, it's super, super fun for her. And so, yeah, she is telling her friends like all about you, like your conversations and what you do when she sees you and, and all the things. If she likes you, her friends know all about you. Quick question for you before we get to the next juicy secrets. We're just getting started, so stay with me. I wanna hear from you in the comments. Would you like more videos like this one? If you would, comment secrets to let me know. Your feedback really helps me as I'm putting together new material, because quite frankly, sometimes I can't come up with any more ideas for videos. So leave any ideas for videos you have in the comments. And if you would like more like this one, comment secrets. And I just wanna give a huge shout out and thank you to those of you who are using the super thanks. I, I'm so humbled and grateful. It really does help me continue to keep this channel going and continue to provide you with such high class, powerful videos. So thank you, thank you, thank you. And if you're enjoying this video and would like to use the super thanks, I would be incredibly grateful. Every time you support me, you're actually just supporting Christian, godly, appropriate advice, and the world needs more of that, right? So thank you so much. My next juicy secret about women is that she is looking at your pictures online. Okay, she just is. Facebook stalking used to be a thing, or everybody teased about Facebook stalking. The truth is, it has expanded far past Facebook at this point. It could be Snapchat or Instagram or wherever you hang out. Bottom line, that's one of the first things a girl wants to do when she meets a new cute guy is she wants to go find you on social media and like look through all your pictures. And she may or may not like screenshot or save like her favorite ones. Maybe, I'm not promising, but most likely. My next juicy secret about women is that the reason a woman will end a relationship is when her needs are not being met. One of the biggest things I, one of the biggest questions I hear as a coach is, okay, so what went wrong, Melanie? <laughs> like I thought everything was going great. And then all of a sudden it just crumbled and she broke it off, she dumped me, she whatever. And I have no idea why. This is why, okay, let's get clear on the why. I'm assuming she's not toxic. I'm obviously not talking about toxic women. The whole reason why she would break it off is because she doesn't feel her needs are being met in the relationship. A relationship always needs your needs to be met and her needs to be met. That's just common sense. The truth is if her needs are not being met, she should break it off. You would, you should do the same if you're ever in that relationship. That's how this should go. However, it might feel really random to you, but it's actually not random. It's simply that her needs are not being met and she decides it's time to just stop this for both your sakes. This is why as a Christian female coach, I guide you through how women think and what they want and what they need in a relationship. Those powerful secrets are part of how you captivate her and melt her heart and make her want to spend her life with you because she's crazy in love with you. That's what I guide you through in detail in my academy. And you will learn more about that as well when you watch that free training. So again, just coachmelanie.com slash masterclass. The beautiful thing is when you understand how to fill her needs and how to attract the right kind of woman for you, both of your needs are met. That's what makes a relationship exciting and loving and happy and like the best experience you can have in this life when both of your needs are being met. That's the kind of relationship everyone longs for. And it's very possible, you just need to know how to create that. You've got to learn how to attract that kind of woman and that's again what I guide you through. Okay, this secret might surprise a few people. This secret is that she wants you to be incredibly gentle. Gentle men quickly become a woman's hero, like totally her hero. It, that's how you impress a woman, okay? That's how you just melt her heart. There are two ways to look at this. There's a gentleman, as in someone who is chivalrous. Whew, that's super hot. And there is a gentle man. And the truth is they pretty much go hand in hand. If you are a gentle man, then you are usually a gentleman. At the end of the day, a tender, feminine, loving, loyal woman is looking for a man who will be a good husband 
and a good father to their children. That's what she's looking for. And a man who is gentle, who is kind, who is supportive. That's the kind of man her heart is safe with. She wants someone she can laugh with, she can cry with, someone she can create beautiful memories with and look forward to spending every day with. That kind of man is a gentleman. Okay, my next secret is that women actually hate to, to turn men down. They hate to have to say no to a date or to reject you in any way. Like, they absolutely hate it. Now, of course, there's always the exception if she's a toxic woman. Again, I'm not talking about that. Toxic women get a thrill out of it, actually. Where non-toxic women, they hate it. It's like one of the hardest things ever. She doesn't want to make you feel bad. She doesn't want you to think it's something personal. She does. She hates confrontation. Okay. That's just a good general rule to understand about women. They hate confrontation. She rather just avoid the whole situation. This is one reason why she will be so careful when she's first getting to know you, especially why she might move a little slower or act a little standoffish at first as she's trying to figure out if this will work. And this is also why when you discover the strategies that help you show her you are the man of her dreams, you are light years ahead of your competition. Because again, she wants you to be that man. She just doesn't want to act too soon and then have to reject you. She'd rather avoid that. Okay, my next secret has to do with one of the biggest things I hear as a coach. So pay close attention. You with me? This secret is that women will often say they are in a relationship when they are afraid to turn you down. Meaning she will not be in a relationship, but she will say she is because she is afraid to turn you down. Now, I want to be clear. Toxic women will be in a relationship and lead you on just so they can have the pleasure of crushing you. That is the sad reality. That's not appropriate. That's not okay. But sadly, that is what toxic women will do. And by the way, if you have no idea what I'm talking about toxic women, make sure you watch this video. I will put a link in the description below. But I'm not talking about toxic women right now, okay? Many women, because they're afraid of confrontation or something has happened when she's been talking to you that has scared her and made her feel like she's not safe, she will say she's in a relationship. One of the biggest scenarios I hear over and over and over again is Melanie. I saw signs she liked me. I started talking to her, whatever. It was going super good. And then all of a sudden she says she's in a relationship with someone. When this happens, it is almost always a sign that something happened to make her feel unsafe. And she's not actually in a relationship, but she's now scared of you. And so she's just trying to get away from the situation. That is not where you want to be at all. This is why discovering the strategies that make her feel incredibly safe with you and drawn to you are so powerful and so important. That's something you must know. If this happens to you a lot, I can almost guarantee this is your problem. And this is something I share more with you about in that free masterclass, so do make sure you watch it. My next secret is that she needs you to be loyal. This is again a need, and it makes sense, right? If you're going to be in a relationship with someone, you need to know they're there for you. There's nothing more excruciating than trusting someone and giving your heart to them and believing you matter to them only to find out you don't. That's awful. It's terrible to offer someone your love or give them your love and have them walk away from it. You can only have a tender, loving relationship when there is loyalty and when there is trust. Far too many people right now are saying that the bad boy is the only guy who can get her attention. And let me just say, he might get her attention, but he will not get her respect unless she's toxic and then it's not really about respect to her, okay? A really good woman, a loyal woman, a tender woman, the kind of woman who's looking for lifelong partner has no interest in a bad boy. Okay? Frankly, she has too much self-respect for that. And one of the reasons why is bad boys aren't loyal. She's looking for a man who will only look at her, who, whose eyes don't wander. She's looking for a man who has that inner integrity because that man will be true to her and he will love her forever, which is what she wants because she wants to love you forever. Moral integrity is what she wants and what she needs in the relationship. If you haven't yet seen this video, make sure you give it a watch. I'll put a link in the description below. This leads us to our next juicy secret. And this is that a woman can look at a man 
think he is insanely attractive and not actually care. <laughs> like, I don't really know how to say that, so let me explain. A woman can think a man is completely attractive, but if she doesn't see the quality she's looking for in a husband, it doesn't matter to her. And it's almost as if he's not attractive. He like becomes not attractive anymore. Far too many people obsess about physical attraction and physical attraction is important. Not to mention it's really fun. It's definitely something she wants in a partner. However, if all she sees is the physical attraction, but she doesn't see the traits she's looking for in a husband, it doesn't matter to her. She can completely walk away and forget his existence entirely. This is why knowing what makes a woman fall in love, which includes physical attraction, but is even more, is so critical. This is part of the secrets I share with you in that free masterclass. And I know I'm bringing that up a lot in today's video, but the truth is it applies very well to everything I'm sharing with you. So make sure you do give it a watch. My next juicy secret about women is that she has baggage too. What do I mean by that? I mean, We've all been hurt, right? We've all got these limiting beliefs. We've all got things we feel self-conscious about. We've all been rejected before. And so every person has this kind of baggage that we're carrying around. So it's important to remember to be patient with each other in relationships. Sometimes we feel like we're the only ones who have any baggage. Now, every single person on planet earth has some and so that may kind of come up in as you are developing a relationship with each other and just be aware that that's probably going to happen because everybody has that this is again why being a gentle man really does just melt her heart and helps her see you're the kind of man she would want to be with just like you are looking for a tender sensitive gentle woman and this leads us to our next juicy secret which is that her needs must be met in the relationship and i know that's something we covered in a previous secret but it's so important it really needs to be talked about again just like you have needs that must be met they they have to be met she does as well that's again why it is so powerful when you discover what it is she even needs, what it is she even wants. And then when you understand how to fill those needs, that's how you're finally successful in love. So if you're sitting there right now and you're like, why am I never successful in love? <laughs> like, why do my relationships not go where I want them to go? This is something you must master. And it's very simple to master. It doesn't have to be complicated. It shouldn't be complicated. So now I have a question for you. Are you sick of wasting your time on relationships that go nowhere? Are you ready to finally find that tender, beautiful woman that you can come home to every night? No more coming home to an empty house and no more getting your hopes up only to have them crushed. Instead, you have that beautiful feminine woman to hold close forever who loves the real you and treats you right. If that's you, if you are nodding your head yes right now, then my academy is exactly for you. This is what I guide you through and help you master fast. The best part is I make it so easy and so simple. The truth is you can keep trying to figure this out on your own and there's a lot of room for error or you can just let me show you how to do it. You can keep guessing what will work or you can let me teach it to you all up front. You can learn how to become successful in love and relationships. You don't have to guess anymore. So to learn more about this and how you can get started today, go to coachmelanie.com slash masterclass. You'll learn more about these powerful strategies there and how you can join me in in that academy. I want you to know that you deserve love. You deserve a gorgeous, tender, feminine woman, and you deserve to get it right the first time instead of getting your hopes up only to have them crushed. And I'm here to help you do it. So make sure you watch that free masterclass. Thank you so much for watching my amazing friend. Make sure you subscribe and ring the notification bell and give me a big thumbs up. I want to hear from you in the comments. What ideas do you have for future videos? And if you enjoyed this one and would like more comment secrets to let me know, make sure you share with a friend who really needs to know these juicy secrets. And if you don't yet follow me on social media, there are links in the description below. Thank you so much again, my amazing friend and have an amazing day. It is time. That's how all great videos start. <laughs> Obviously.
Hello, how else would they start? <laughs> All right, I think I'm ready. Don't take my stuff out, just go. Just do it. Okay, here I go. Okay, sorry, I had to rehearse it in my head first. You know how some people talk with their hands? I think with my hands. <laughs> it's kind of not that funny because like I'll be sitting there and it looks like I'm nuts. <laughs> but that's okay. You know, just ignore it. I'd say it'll go away, but it won't. Just ignore it. <laughs> okay, here we go. You might look at me and think everything's going fine, but I have a deep dark secrets. My left leg has fallen asleep and it hurts. <laughs> like really bad. <laughs> but I'm pulling it off super chill, right? You can't even tell. <laughs> I don't know what that had to do with anything, but I just wanted to share that with you. Okay. <laughs> Back to the video. Ah, my foot's asleep. My foot's asleep. My foot's asleep. <laughs> That's my foot's asleep song. You're welcome. <laughs> um, you'll have to give me credit, but feel free to use that wherever you would like, you know. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> Do you think I could get royalties for that? I feel like I should. <laughs> it's going to show up in a TV show somewhere. You just wait. <laughs> Except I don't watch TV, so I wouldn't know. <laughs> oh... Okay, secret rock star club. Our special word for today is green. I have no idea why. That's just the word that popped in my head. So we're going to go with green. So if you're one of the exceptional people who watches to the end of the video, let me know. Comment green. This is like our little secret club that nobody knows about except those who know. So comment green. 